Seattle Mariners make a deal here, and they acquire Adam Frazier from the San Diego Padres. So the Padres at the trade deadline got Frazier last season, but now they flip him over here to the San Diego Padres for Ray Kerr and outfielder Corey Rozier. So right here, Frazier, he was good last season between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Padres. Five home runs, 43 RBIs, 10 stolen bases, 83 runs scored, a 305 batting average and a 368 on base with 577 at-bats. So right here, for fantasy baseball, he qualifies as second base in outfield. And Frazier's been a solid player over the last few seasons here with pretty good batting average and on base percentage. The only thing, he's not going to hit for a lot of power. Stolen bases anywhere from 10 to 15 a season at most. And now he goes over here in Seattle. That's a team that's trying to compete and get better. And this is a win-now type of move here. For the Seattle Mariners. They didn't give up much in this trade. And Frazier right now. Is a good addition to this roster. That needs more bats in their lineup. So as far as fantasy baseball goes. He's a guy I'm probably going to target. Anywhere from the 8th to the 10th round. In fantasy drafts here. Before the season starts. When the drafts come up in the next few months. So right here. 13 in two seasons. But like I said. He's a rental pretty much as Frazier. And the Padres. It looks like they're going to be cutting costs a little. After the last few seasons going out there, making big trades and taking on big contracts. But now they're getting rid of Frazier here in this deal and hoping these two guys at least pan out a little or could be part of the roster. So Adam Frazier traded to the Seattle Mariners for two minor league prospects. And we'll see what kind of season he'll have over here in the American League after spending his career in the National League. And I think we're going to see a lot of trades around the league in the next few days.